have the same taste in footwear, so what? Yes, that may be, but it's funny what else you realize when one thing falls into place. Like I realize that you and Word Girl are the same height, the same hairstyle, and color! Oh, that's ridiculous. The same sparkling smile, the same ruby lips, the same... I realize I've said too much. To us! Word Girl! I, I mean, uh, Word Girl. Yes, and? And there's gotta be something in your life you're thankful for. Well, I suppose there is one thing. Great! What is it? I'm grateful for wood. <clears throat> Robots. Yeah, see? Come on! Let's put the squeeze on her for good! <laughs> no, surely we can think of a much more diabolical way to teach her a lesson. We both know you're just stalling because you have a silly schoolboy crush on her. I do not! Do too, do too. Well, I still think you're up to no good, McAllister, and I'm going to keep my eye on you. Oh, by all means, spend every second of the contest by my side, watching my every move, holding my sweaty hand. Mumbling. I said hoping I'm a lucky man. I'm really impressed by your dedication. And my superior intelligence. Well, yes, that too, I guess. You know, we make a pretty good team. Yes. <clears throat> if only my lab partner, Becky Botsford, was more like you. Toby, I still don't trust you. Oh, word girl, you don't have to trust me. You just have to love me. What? Nothing. Wow, that must have taken ages to put together. How long have you been standing here? Oh, forever. I think my mother is trying on the whole store. Yours too, huh? My mom once spent four hours trying on jeans. Ask me how many pairs she bought. How many? None! Maddening. Absolutely maddening. I... Are we? Uh, so, uh, you gonna blow something up or what? Right, 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 uh, blow something up. Of course.